The woman was wholly seduced, but the man, the spiritual intellectual soul, was not wholly seduced. He knew, knew what he was doing. He knows what he's doing. So the war, Jesus Christ's war, is against the spiritual intellectual soul that should know better. The woman is wholly seduced. Listen. The woman is wholly This is a spiritual principle now. The woman is wholly seduced and will be seduced again over and over and over again. That's the spiritual principle. So the Lord Jesus Christ is at war with the higher soul, the intellectual soul, okay? That's reasoning God out of existence. And when, he, when that intellectual soul that's reasoning God out of existence is replaced by Christ Jesus, okay, the woman that's seduced easily, which is the, which is the person, the personality, okay, which is a simple personality compared to the intellectual soul, she will stop being seduced when the higher soul within her is Christ Jesus, who will tell only who only speaks the truth. So the woman is seduced by the higher soul that's within within herself. The reason she's so seduced is that she's joined to that soul. She cannot stand against that soul. Brethren, it's a spiritual principle that it's a very rare person, a very rare person that can stand against authority that has current access over them. It's very hard, and actually it's considered a, a sin to, to rebel against authority. You should only rise up against it if it's an ungodly authority that's causing you to sin or teaching you to sin.